may not remember what I'm saying. So it's good you have your pen close to you. Now we talk about obsession. You must be obsessed in creating millionaires or in becoming a millionaire for those of us that are yet to become a millionaire in this business. Yes, you must be obsessed for you to create the desired result that you want. Now you need to know that obsession takes time. When you talk about being obsessed, mean you are passionate about what you're doing. Being obsessed means you're crazy about what you're doing. It takes time. It takes energy and it takes what? Money. Switch yourself to something meaningful that will do what? That will serve the world. This is a business of helping people. You cannot be successful in this world or in life without you helping a lot of people. Now, the business of the connected economy is connecting people to goods and service to make supplementary income. Either for you to make supplementary income, significant income, or for you to make a fortune, which is what? The residual income. Now, while you are doing this, you must learn how to mentor people who do the same. Because if, you, if you're making money in this business and you're not mentoring people to become like you, then trust me, your wealth in this business or your fame in this business will not last long. So you must do things. You must draw your business professionally. And thank God we have the system and the structure of the RDI NGO. If you're here and you have not connected, you are not working hand in hand with your leader or your offline, I will advise you to do the same. If you don't know who your leader or your offline is, ask questions. You need to be working bomba to bomba with your offline and your leaders. Now, your success in the connected economy is you mentoring and helping people create supplementary income and residual income. This is a business of helping people to succeed without you being selfish. Yes. Why must you be obsessed about this business? I know many of you be asking, will be saying, why must I be obsessed about this business? Number one, whatever you become obsessed in, you become an authority in it. If you are crazy about this business, then trust me, you become an authority in it. Everything you're looking for in life is embedded in this business. Personal development, each and every one of us are receiving it. Is it money? Money is in this business. The person you become in this business is priceless. There's nothing as, in fact, the person you become is the, is the individual that the world is looking out for. And who is that person? You becoming a leader, a leader of your life and a leader in this business. The most sorted people in the world are leaders. They are very few and difficult to find. And that is the privilege this business is giving us. So you must learn how to do what you must you must, you, must, you must learn how to take advantage of the tool you have in your hand. Remember, in this business, you gain personal development. You gain money, contributions, impact to yourself, to your family, and to your society at large. This, is a, this business is a one, in fact, I always call it a one stop for everybody. Why? Because in this business, you can achieve a lot. In all areas of your life, you can achieve that. This business can give you all you need and you desire. Show me a man or a woman that is successful in this business and I'll show you a man or a woman that have accomplished great heights in life. Know that in this business, you will experience family challenges. That's number one. Each and every one of us have our story. When I started this business, my family were not in support of what I was doing. When I started this business, a lot of them, in fact, a lot of them turned their back at me. But when I told myself that I was going to embarrass all, I'm going to embarrass their attitude with massive success. After two years, right now, almost all of them are backing me up in this business. So in this business, prepare yourself. You're going to experience family challenges. Your parents, your wife, your mother, they are not supporting you. Your children, your siblings, your friends, they are not supporting you. It's normal. All of us have faced that. In this business, you're going to be spending less time with what? With your family members and friends. Why? Because you're obsessed towards achieving your goal. In this business, your religious life, your social life, your relationship life will decline. Yes. Many of us have started noticing it. But guess what? You will get everything back in time freedom. Remember, our goal in this business is what? Freedom. You must learn how to pay the price. A price must be paid in order for you to receive a price. In the building phase of this business, it takes a lot from you. But at the end, at the end result, trust me, everything will be worth it. This business is about helping people. Now, there are things you need to know 
and do in order for it to be obsessed in this business. Things to be obsessed with in this business, number one, you must be high on personal development, meaning you must be very crazy on personal development, feeding your mind and feeding your soul. Because the truth is, the only way you can give out is by what? Having that. You can't give what you don't have. Now, you must ensure that you attend our cell meetings. You must ensure you attend our mind shift, both the training going online and offline. You must ensure you attend our millionaire class. The millionaire um, class will be starting very soon. You must ensure you attend our mastermind training, our VIP training. Oh my God, I pity many of us that when a training is going on by our by the director of the, of the RDI, by the ambassadors, you're not there. I pity you guys. You must make sure that you don't miss any of this training, our VIP coaching training by the director, by the allied ambassadors of the RDI. Don't miss it for the world. Now, you need to, the second thing you need to do in order to be obsessed in this business is you mastering the seven skills. The seven skills that you need to be massively successful in this business. These skills are required for you to succeed in this business. And what are those skills? Number one, invitation skills is a skill. You learn it. Number two, prospecting skills. Number three, presentation skills. Number four, closing skills. Number five, follow-up skills. And number six, what? Promoting events, building of team. These are skills that you need to attain massive success in this business. Now you must do what? You must master it. But above all, you must be addicted to making your teammates become millionaires. If you're here in this business and people have started connecting to this business through your ID, then you are now a leader. If you're here and you're not yet a millionaire, your aim is in less than six months, you have to become a millionaire. We have the system, we have the strategy. All you need to do is to ask, learn and follow through and let your offline or your leader guide you through. Yes, so you must be addicted to making your teammates become millionaires. Now, be on fire with any teammates that is ready to work. Be obsessed with helping your teammates to succeed in this business. When you don't stand for something, trust me, you will fall for anything. So stand your ground today and tell yourself that you are committed to becoming a millionaire and making your teammates millionaires in this business. Stand for the RDI NGO. If you don't stand for something, Trust me, you fall for anything. I, I, I urge each and every one of us today to stand for the RDI NGO. Carry your business on the head like a hawker. The way hawkers carry their business, they are what they sell, moving around. Carry your business on your head like a hawker to become a legendary in this business, for you to become a master in this business, for you to become a hall of fame in this business. Trust me, you cannot run this business without people calling you names. In my house, what do they call me? They call me Mega Money because they former we once I once ran a project called Mega Mo. Some of my friends, in fact, some people when they see me, they'll say, Ah, Madam Alliance. Some people when they see me, they'll say, Ah, Madam RDI. You must stand for something. Obsession takes your energy, it takes time, it takes money. These are essential variables for you to be successful. So learn how to focus in this business. You don't need to like this business for you to succeed. You don't need to do that. You don't need to like this business for you to do it. Do this business because of the result that you want it to bring for you. Focus on the end result. Why, some people ask me, how is it that I succeed in this business? How is it that it seems as if I don't face challenges? Let me tell you, I face a lot of challenges, but I don't allow the challenges to hold me down. Why? I'm focused on the results I want to produce. So you must know this. This business is for the strong mind, the strong in mind. This business is not for everybody. It's for the strong in mind. It's for the 1% crazy. This business is mentally taxing. And it's, that is why you see in the world, 98% people are working for the 2% people that are crazy to make a change in life. So what am I trying to advise each and every one of us? Today, make a decision, be a participator, be a participator in everything we are doing in this business, not a spectator. Who, says, who stays in the game no matter what? No matter the challenges, stay in the game. Till you, that desired result that you want to achieve is accomplished. Don't be a spectator in this business. The truth is talk is cheap, but guess what? Action is expensive. 
residual income is for the one percent crazy is the one percent crazy that makes the world a better place and that is why you see in the cash flow quadrant is only three percent of the world population makes things happen why because this group of people are people that are ready to be crazy remember the one percent crazy are the people that make a change in the world will this pillar i want each and every one of us to take advantage of the pillar the two we have in our hand because with it you can achieve your goal now the fifth blueprint i need us to take note of is what challenge 36 if you've not been paying attention and if you've not been writing this is the best time for you to write the next thing you need in order to succeed this year in our business is what i call the challenge 36. what's the challenge 36. how do you participate in the challenge 36. now number one have a timetable filled with all the activities have a timetable whereby every day you are prospecting you are inviting you're presenting the business either inviting people to zoom doing the presentation by yourself if you've been trained or sharing the big videos you are doing following follow up you are closing and you are building your team members have a timetable filled with all this activity in order for you to build a large business empire Select five persons that you will work with in this business. Select five persons that will work with you in this business that are ready to go all crazy. That five persons are ready to go crazy like you and are on different legs of your genealogy. I hope you guys got that. Look for five persons. For you to be among the 1% crazy in this business, look for five persons that are crazy like you. And these five persons must be on different legs of your genealogy. For those of us that understand what I mean, if you don't understand what I mean, just take note of it. Later, you can ask question, what is, what's the meaning of genealogy? Now, make sure that those five persons are on five different legs of your genealogy. Now, each should have their own teamwork with all of them. Each of them should have their own team. Work with all of them to make sure that each team generates 36 code in 30 days. Leaders, hope you guys are hearing me. Work with all of them to make sure that each five of them, each of them and their team, their success line, produce 36 code in 30 days. If you do this successfully, you will make 1.8 million Naira as a connector in this business. I hope you guys got me. Because this is where I'm laying down, I'm laying out the blueprint, things you need to do. This is the structure, this is the foundation for the results you want in this business. And I believe the result you want in this business is massive success. Do this, like I said, get five persons that are crazy like you. Make sure that these five persons are on different legs of your genealogy. Now, once you make sure they're on different legs of your genealogy, work with them. Whatever you're doing with them, let them duplicate for themselves. Make sure that you and these five persons and your team produce 36 code. 36 code means 36 shopping. Get 36 new business partners connected to the business. You and those five persons in 30 days. That is in one month. You and your team members should work towards getting 12 people to attend our online Zoom presentation or offline presentation in the offices or watching our video. Now, if you do this in 30 days, you will have 360 people. Now, guess what? I know each and every one of us know our 444 worksheet. Now, I want us to add extra one worksheet. Let's make it 555 worksheet. Now, the 555 worksheet will be created. Just add one to our normal 444 worksheet. Consequently, um, consequently for the team that succeed, in the challenge of the 36 um, persons, 36 new business partners in one month, should duplicate it in their five five worksheet. Meaning, once you achieve, get your five to achieve their own by duplicating and initiating this in, for your team members immediately. And trust me, millionaires will be reigning in your team. This is the secret to creating millionaires in this business. Now, create a state of emergency if you and your team members does not produce 36 new business partners in one month. Create a state of emergency, meaning you are not to be happy or comfortable and you don't deserve anything good 
till you and your team members generate that. Now, this is our vision. Our vision for 2023-2024 is to raise 10,000 millionaires, making nothing less than 1 millionaire between now and next year, 2023, is to raise 10,000 millionaires, making nothing less than 1 millionaire every month. Now, this mission and vision is not for the feeble hearted. It's not for everybody. So don't feel bad when people are not going along. This vision is not for the child at heart, people that are thinking like children at heart. It's not for them. This vision and mission is not for people who give excuses, the pessimistic nag, cowards to adversity of rejection. This vision is not for them. This vision is for the courage at heart. The unbendable, the unstoppable, the uncheckable, people that are ready to unleash the lion in them, people that are ready to fly like an eagle, no matter the height. Now, function outside the limitation of your excuses. You must learn how to function outside the limitation of your excuses. Creating millionaires, no excuse. That should be your that should be your mantra this year. I'm creating millionaires this year, no excuses. Now, what are excuses? Excuses are the currency with which you use in buying failure. <laughs> I hope you guys got me. Excuses are the currency with which you use in buying what? Failure. If you know you understood what I said, go to the chat box and type what? Excuses are the currency one used in buying what? Failure. Let's go to the chat box because the truth is, as much as we are hungry and eager to achieve massive success, you see these excuses is part of what we need to discipline ourselves with. Yes, you must discipline yourself in it. Excuses are the currency with which you use to buy failure. Anybody and everybody can achieve what they want in life, but if they are ready to cancel and discard excuses, they say resort cancels insult. But the only way you can cancel your insults is by canceling your what? Your excuses. Rise up to become the lion that you are. Rise up to become the eagle that you are. Excuses, no matter how valuable they are, are the reason why you can't achieve your desired results and you remain where you are. Those things you're using as excuses, use it as a reason why you must succeed in this business. Some people use their husband, their wife, their children, their parents, their spouse as excuses. There should be the motivating factor why you should succeed in this business. Excuses is when you are still playing small. You see others running and you choose to work in this business. Instead of you to do what, you're, what others are doing, what lions are doing, you choose to do what, um, which animal will I use now? You choose to do what cattle are doing. Excuses is when you are not a millionaire. You can become a millionaire in less than six months in this business. It's achievable. I have achieved it. I have helped a lot of people achieve it. So can you. Excuses is the only thing stopping you from not being who you are supposed to be in this business. Excuses. Excuses is when you are not ready to create other multi-millionaires, other millionaires like you. Excuses are what separate champions from losers. Champions reject excuses, while losers accept it. Champions stay far from excuses. Losers accommodate excuses. You are never defeated until you accept excuses. Excuses are your worst enemy. They appear to be your best friend to support you, but at the end, they are no good for you. So what you need to do is to divorce and discard all your excuses divorce all your excuses discard them no matter how valid excuses are do not accommodate them excuses are like virus they enter your body and guess what they intoxicate your what your mind you can make you can't make money and make excuses at the same time you have to choose one is either you're making money or you are making what or you are making excuses you cannot make both so it's either you make money or you're making excuses. Excuses come to everybody, but who houses the excuses is the person that become infected by it. Successful people turn their back to excuses, and that is why they get the desired results that they want. 
Excuses are meant to be overcome and not for it to overcome you. Man is not meant to give excuses. That is why man, that is why man gave excuses and was thrown out of the garden of Eden. When God said, why did you eat this fruit? fruit? He said, it's the woman you gave me. God does not give excuses. When, when you know that each and every one of us are made in the image and likeness of God, you are what? You know that you are now a problem solver, a solution provider. Man has a soul to empower and to dominate this earth. When you give excuses, you allow the earth to dominate you. We are all designed to be conquerors. So ask yourself, are you ready to become a conqueror? Now, so, some common excuses that people give is this. And let's listen attentively. When excuses like this come, this is how to attack your words, your excuses. Number one, people say, I don't have money. Now, the great and the successful people in our business today, they borrow money to start. Someone like me. 2017, when this business came to me, I didn't have money. Immediately, I had to borrow money and I promised to pay back in two weeks. The moment I borrowed, I got started with this business. I sold all my three products in order to pay the money I was owing and focus in my business. Go and check. A lot of successful people in this business, 80% borrowed money to get started with this business. Number two, when people tell you, I don't know how to convince people, then you, this is the reply to that. I don't know how to convince people either, but I learned it. Whatever you don't know, you can do what? Learn. Convincing begins with you, with you having enough knowledge of the subject matter. And that is why we keep emphasizing on training. Without training, you cannot succeed in this business. When you are not well informed, because training gives you a lot of information about the business. When people ask you a question, you'll be able to defend the question that is being asked. Number three, when people tell you, um, make talking um, to people your team. I always tell people, when people say, I don't know how to talk, you need to learn how to make talking your team. If a closed mouth, even in the Bible, is a closed destiny. If doctors refuse to talk to patients, how will they succeed in the business? If teachers refuse to talk to st students, how will they succeed? If the politicians refuse to talk to people, will they succeed? Make talking to people your team. The people you see today have mastered the skill. Someone like me, I used to be a conk and a stinch introvert. I used to lock myself in the cupboard, hide myself from people. I hate associating with people. That was who I am. If you knew me back then when I was in secondary school and the woman I am today, you know that it's a two different things. So the people you see today that are succeeding in this business, they've mastered the skill. And now they are successful because they became interested in it. So learn to master the skill. I wasn't like this before. I don't know how to talk before. But I made a decision to do or master my skill. I canceled all my excuses because I knew that the life I want, if I keep giving excuses, oh, I'm shy. I can't stand in front of people. I can't do this. I can't. All those I can't is killing my dream. Remember, the word impossible. If you look at it well, you see that it means I am possible. All, when people tell you all my success lines are not working, what do you say? What do you do? How do you attack that excuse? Go and make them work and keep recruiting new people. When people tell you, I don't know anybody, I don't know anyone. If you don't know people, then it's time for you to go and do what? Socialize and get to know people. Anywhere I go, I make it a point of contact, even in a bus, in a KK, when I'm on flight, anywhere I go, I make it a point of contact to socialize with people in order to do what? To do what? To add them to my contact list. Now, when people tell you, all my friends don't want to join, that's an excuse. Then go out and look for strangers. Let me tell you, your family and your friends are not the people that will make you succeed in this business. Strangers are the people that will make you succeed. When you're struggling in life, your family and your friends will not be there. Strangers are the people that will be there to help you. But when you finally succeed, guess what? Those, those family and friends that were not there for you will be there for you, with you to do what? To celebrate. So go and look for strangers. 
we have a system at which you can use to attract strangers to this business. Learn it and master it. People will say this business is hard. The truth is, business is hard, true. Also, poverty is hard. To be rich is hard. To be poor is hard. Choose your hard. Yes, choose your hard. Which hard will you choose? Will you rather prefer to do the hard work to become poor or will you prefer to do the hard work to become rich? Choose your hard. Some, of, so, some people will say, oh, a lot of people are not accepting. That is the more reason you are being paid to get people to join this business. How do you make money? It's by connecting people to the system. There are seven ways of making money. But the major way by which people make money out of the seven ways is what? Connecting people to the system. Why do you think people are any more in this, in, in this business? It's because they made it a point of duty to become a professional in connecting people to the system professionally through our system and our structure. So if people are not joining, then it, the company is paying you well for you to connect people to the system. Now, some persons will say puzzle schemes are everywhere. That's the reason why people are not joining this business. That's an excuse. Let me tell you something. Puzzle scheme have actually opened the market for us to succeed and show people our business. Yes. Puzzle schemes have dealt with a lot of people and that's why people don't believe in businesses anymore. Guess what? Puzzle scheme have opened the market for us to show people how credible, how genuine and how real our business is. You are the last hope of people. You are the hope people are waiting for go and give them that hope it's time for you to make our business known to people because it's genuine is what in fact is a world-class business globally governments have approved it every global a, a business that have been approved by different governments different governments um, of different countries around the world produce over 30 self-made multi-millionaire what else could be real more than that a business that have been that have proven to surpass the the momentum stage that is now in a sustainable stage in business that even in COVID nineteen was busy paying their customers. What other proof do you need? Some people will say I used to be a champion of excuses. Yes, someone like me back in the day. I am in fact I was once a champion of excuses until the day my eye opened and I knew that. The excuses I'm giving are killing me and blocking my destiny. I knew that my excuses are the reason why I'm not succeeding. I knew that if I keep giving excuses, the life I want, I won't have it. That day, I canceled all my excuses and I took the boon by the horn. Now, money is in the things that are hard, not the things that are easy. You are paid to get the word, accept the connected economy in the most critical period in, of, of, of our, uh, of our um, generation. That's the truth. You are being paid. We are in the connected economy. A lot of people are now aware. A lot of people will keep losing jobs. This recession, some of us don't even know what this recession is. Some of us have not even felt the impact of this recession. You are being paid to do what? To get people know about the connected economy. Because soon, robot is going to take over everything robot is here and it has come to stay when robot has taken over all the jobs what are you left with you're left with what the connected economy so our project this year is to produce ten thousand millionaires through the rdi system our goal this year is to help though um, our director will be launching it very soon is to feed 1000 families by december this year to put smiles on people's face. Our goal as an NGO this year is to, we have projects about getting children back to school, helping the widow. We have a lot of projects, but I won't go deep in that. Our director will be the one to launch that for us. So in closing, because I'm about rounding up, why things were uncertain last year, 2020, is because a lot of people are going to make money this year, 2021. I don't know if you guys understand that. When things are hard and difficult, it means that the world has changed. There has been a revolution. A lot of people will become poor and lose their job. 
and money will shift, money will change direction and go to a different sector whereby a lot of people will become what? Millionaires and billionaires. So you need to pay attention to the connected economy because in this connected economy, a lot of people, more especially this year, 2021, a lot of people will make a lot of money. Many people will be forced to give up their excuses to build a connected economy. That's the reality. That's what's happening now. People are losing their job. Since, 20, um, since 2017, or I mean 2016, we started this business. People did not believe in us. 2017, they still called it a scam. 2018, they did not believe. 2019, they did not believe. 2020, they believed. Even in 2020, a lot of people that do not believe you in this business, this 2021, they will believe because you guys don't even know what is happening in the government, the, the, um, the industrial sector. You guys don't even know what's happening. A lot of people that do not believe in you in this business, you see this year, they will believe because the next revolution is the technology, the robots. Robots is taking over. And that is why the last hope for humankind is the connected economy. So a lot of people will be forced to give up their excuses and join this business. Yes, join the connected economy business. Or they will be placed below the poverty line. Be the loudest noise maker. Let me tell you, for you to succeed in this business, make sure that people hear about this business from you. Be the loudest noise maker. Because when you are the loudest noise maker, when it's time for them to give up their excuses, they'll remember you. The harvest of the connected economy is right there will be influx of people coming into our business because there is no other option. Everyone will come back to the connected economy because that is the last hope for humankind when the robot takes over. The harvest for the connected economy is right. My question is this, will you listening to me right now be around to reap the fruit of the harvest? Because a lot of people are coming back to us or will you be as absential because you quit in this business. That's the question I have for each and every one of you. Now, this RDI NGO, the Realistic Dream Initiative NGO, is currently running a zero to multi-millionaire. That's the third project we are running in three years. Currently running the zero to multi-millionaire project. This project is here to help a lot of people to live a massively successful life full of abundance. Are you going to be part of that abundance. Finally, our business is a business of helping people. That is why we will never go down. For those of you thinking we'll go down, we will never go down because our business is a business of helping people. God helps and facilitates whatever you do in helping people to become successful. And that is why you will never, that is why you will never quit so as to empower and help a lot of people. The less privilege help them go to school, build a business, help a lot of people actualize their goals. You must have a heart of good to succeed in this business. Now, each and every one of us, I'm so excited and happy to welcome each and every one of us to a new year, 2021. If you can discipline yourself, pay attention, Act using the structure of the NGO. Operate using our system. Discipline yourself and be principled. Trust me, this 2021, the sky will be your starting point. This 2021, you'll be among those that will be celebrated. This 2021, you'll be among those that will leave their mark on the sand of the connected economy. And that is why I want to close with this affirmation. I sent us this affirmation before, but I'm going to say it again for those of us that have not been paying attention to pay attention to it. Say this to yourself every morning you wake up. Make it a point of duty to affirm this to yourself. Now, this is how I say my affirmation. So, edit it to your name. I am eminent Augusta Ihezo. I have a heart of gold. A heart that cares for the success of other people. I am selfless, always looking out for my teammates and my prospects. People that join my business become successful within a short period of time. I am disciplined and I follow through in all my commitments. I am a success and I create success at will. 
Nobody, nothing can stop me from realizing and actualizing my dream and my potential in the connected economy. I am a multi-millionaire and I'm a millionaire creator and I have no excuse. Welcome to 2021, my year of creating millionaires with no excuses. That is my affirmation. I affirm this to myself every morning and trust me, no matter the challenges I face, no matter how recession hits the jungle, a lion will never eat grass. Thank you very much for your time this evening. I believe that this blueprint has sink into each and every one of us, into our mind, into our soul, into our spirit, because you need the momentum now. Thank you very much as I end this section. Um, I don't know if we have anything to say, but um, one thing I want to add to us is a lot of things where the idea is planning on a lot of things. We'll be unveiling a lot of things. Our Mind Shifts program, our millionaire class program, our um, VIP mentorship classes, our masterminds, a lot of things is coming. Remember, lion moves with lion. So ask yourself, will you be a conqueror this year? Or will you be among the spectators that are sitting down to watch? Or will you be a partaker? Will you be a participator in this new revolution? Thank you very much. Thank you very much. As I get started with each and every one of us on our action, execution, income generating activities. Remember, be among the 1% crazy that is ready to cancel all their excuses and do whatever it takes no matter what to achieve your dream thank you very much thank you very much thank you very much as i look towards working with each and every lion in the rdi ngo thank you very much and have a good night god bless you i love you all bye